Well, the other body found inside a house was discovered this afternoon on Youngstown's north side. She was identified as Olvius Harris. She was found inside her house on Fairgreen Avenue. Tonight, they're searching for these two, her boyfriend, 45-year-old Maurice Lloyd, and their two-year-old son, Glover Lloyd. Maurice is not a suspect. They want to make sure both of them are safe, and they want to talk. Now, before he was in Salem, Nathan Lahota was on the north side. He has the new developments of what's going on. The investigation into Alavis Harris's death started when her mother called 911. The mother was concerned. I hasn't talked to her daughter in a couple of days. Gladys Espinoza says her daughter missed appointments. One of her friends called me and told me that they came past here on the bus to get her. And Maurice came out and said that she already got a ride, but she never did show up to the clinic. Espinosa says Elvis was living with her boyfriend Maurice Lloyd and their two-year-old son Glover at the Lloyd's house on the corner of Fairgreen and Juanita Avenues. That's where she and police found her daughter's body. I started to knock the door down, but my sister told me no. So we called the police, the landlord came, let them in, and that's when they found my daughter. Espinosa says Elvis and Maurice were having relationship problems. She just started telling me bits and pieces because she got tired of it and she wanted to get away. And I was supposed to come up here to 10th and get her. But I, I, as you can see, I'm too late. Police say Maurice is not a suspect. We just want to talk to him and see. I mean, it could be very legitimate reasons why they're not here. Um, we just want to check on their welfare. In Youngstown, Nathan Lahota, WKBN 27 First News.